Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Elle and this channel is all about being stylish on a budget. And just now I just done filming another video. That's why you are, you will be seeing me wearing the same outfit, but I just changed the hairstyle a little bit because my fringe was crazy earlier. Always crazy to be honest. So I just pinned it up and change my earrings to complement the hair clips that I have over here yeah not the this is the very past season trend but I still like it I just started to like it I hate it before yeah but stop rambling and today is the yay or nay series time okay <laughs> and I just got a new pair of shoes for me to review from this brand Pineapple Orbiter and this is definitely not a well-known brand I've been searching more information about this from the YouTube from the internet I just couldn't find that much except like a Facebook page for for the brand if I whatever I can find um, from the internet definitely I will link it in the description box below all right so let's get started okay guys here is the shoes let's check it out together yeah I opened it before check it out before already but yeah this is it Oops, let me just take this one out first. This one. Oops, sorry about that. Okay, very simple. Nothing so fancy about the shoebox, the wrapping. Right. This is the shoes, guys. Look at this. Very gorgeous, right? So just let me hold um, no, one of the side of this pair first. Okay, guys. Why I pick this shoe this time? First of all, it's really giving me the vibe of Jimmy Choo's glittered pump. And I believe you guys agree too. And this one is in silver color. Oh, look at this and it is very soft and this one to be honest guys when I receive this when I have a look for this palms it is beyond my beyond what I anticipated all right guys so this heels obviously is a glitter um, high heel palms all right and this material, the upper material, is made from the cow leather. So, as I mentioned before, even though I picked um, any um, shoes randomly based on the brand, but I will look carefully into the material. So, this is one of the strong reasons why I pick these shoes. So, the upper side is made from the cow leather. And from the for the insole guys, it is made from the combo of sheep and pig leather. So for the pig, I believe from here side because normally um, for pig skin, uh, it has like a big or obvious um, pores. I'm not so sure whether you guys can see or not, but for this one, it's surprisingly almost visible for the pore. Okay, and for the outsole, it's made from rubber. And even though it is made from rubber, it's really giving me the wood vibe. And I'm so happy with the um, entire slip over here. And something is written here, but I couldn't read it since it's written in Chinese. Okay, 
and more product information as I mentioned in my previous video always look at the 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 details over here for the upper it is made from leather insole is made from leather and the outsole is made from the synthetic or rubber and for the look it has the pointed um, toe it is a slip on of course slip on heels and it has 11 centimeters high for the heels with the black cap or heels cover over here and based on the workmanship guys because in my first episode for this series I didn't mention the workmanship first before I tried it on I really 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 impressed because I didn't see anything wrong with it I didn't see any um, glue beside you any you know like mist attach for the shoes not only for this side of the pair as well as this one it is nearly perfect so out of 10 I'm going to give this shoes 8.5 for the workmanship yeah and in terms of the price in terms of the price because I have all the details over here for these heels guys the original or the selling price um, at the Zalora website was $159 but I purchased this at only $66.90 yes $66.90 one of another strong reason why I get these shoes because below 100 made from leather beautifully made glittered yes I am booked that's why I um, I didn't hesitate to get this one and unfortunately guys I couldn't link anything about these shoes in the description box below it is because this was the only pair that Zalora um, had before and coincidentally it is in my size and my size is my foot size is 38 so this one is in the size of 38 I'm so glad it fits me perfectly but I'm not so sure yet about the comfort of these shoes. So for this week, I'm going to wear this walking around to buy my groceries, to go take out, dressy, with the mask on, but with very dressy kind of heels. But I think it is important to share with you guys the comfort and my last thoughts, my final opinions about this one. So... I'll be right back okay guys now I'm back and I'm ready to give the full review for these heels okay and let's get started all right guys right now I would like to talk about the comfort of these shoes when I um, first wearing this first using this outside my right foot got blistered at the back and it was um, kind of not to say extremely painful but still painful at the front of my um, feet it is because you know like for 11 centimeter height your pressure will be more to the front side so it, it is um, pretty normal but it, if you if you really want to you know like use or wear this type of shoes you really need to break into it first and for the first time i'm wearing this i have to wear it together with this pad so this is my hacks actually how to get um, comfortable in heels so this one is actually really helping me to fit um, perfectly into the heels and yeah 
this shoe was pretty tight at the front and I think at that time I should have the back padding instead but unfortunately I do not have any right now and yeah during circuit breaker there is no way I could go and find it but I didn't intend to get one in the same time it is because I prefer to have the front tail padding instead of the back I don't know why it is because to me at least this one is also giving the extra cushion and it protects the front part of the heels especially it you know like we tend to leave like um, black marks at the front yeah but with the padding extra padding we actually can avoid that that is how actually um, how I keep my shoes um, clean um, in the interior side and after that even though I'm using this um, extra pad over here it's quite even though it's quite tight but not that bad but here I still feel like there is a problem like it couldn't my feet couldn't like fit or snuggle proper um properly at this part so I change it into the full length padding this one and this one actually giving um extra comfort honestly because the cushion is from this side all the way at the back so I don't it fits um, much much better compared wearing this type of pad so this kind of um, this kind of paddings really really help me to feel more comfortable with my heels and after that after I've been wearing this one outside I feel like I managed to break into it into it which is right now I do not have to wear all this already it snuggled perfectly with my feet even though it's a bit bigger here but at least it don't feel like it's it's not feel like it's gonna like coming off from your um, feet if you get what I mean yeah it's getting uh, more comfortable now because I been wearing these shoes like honestly only like four times outside and the rest of it I've been wearing um, it around the house like a crazy woman suddenly in a very dressy heels all right and I'm glad because I know that this the more you're wearing this the more you be um, become comfortable in it however this is not a shoes that you can walk in more than one hour straight. If you're going out, maybe you're going to a party, you intend to dance all night long, I think this shoes is still okay for that because normally you maybe just sit, relax, rest first and then only that you maybe continue dancing if you if that is the kind of thing that you love to do or if you just go out um, at night with your friends or on a date I think this shoes is really really giving extra to the whole outfit and yes look at this guys it really reminds me of the Jimmy Choo's um, glitter shoes glitter um, heels so if you are really um, on a budget but you don't want to spend um, that um, a lot of money on a pair of shoes I think this one is a great alternative or a great dupe to the Jimmy Choo's heels but when it comes to their comfort side it is not gonna be as comfortable as the Jimmy Choo's of course and for this um, for the comfort of these shoes I'm going to rate it um, about 7.8 out of 10 because like I said I got a blistered and it was not that comfortable at first and um, after I managed to break into it it is getting more comfortable however it is not like a shoes for you to walk in for more than one hour or like two hours I don't think so so this shoes is made not made for that but this shoes is really giving the statement for the whole look 
with Tilda Great and Fabulous in the same time and most importantly on a budget yes. so guys overall in conclusion whether this is a yay or a nay shoes for me this is a yay shoes so overall I'm going to rate this um, 8 out of 10 because it is very beautiful the more you um, wear this the more it's getting um, comfortable of course and yeah the only thing is that this shoes is not made for all occasion but still it is giving you know like an extra look for the whole um, outfit especially if you are like the Jimmy Choo's glitter heels so if you are on a budget and you still want to have something similar to that I think this is the great alternative for it okay okay guys that will be all for today if you like this video please give it a thumbs up if you like this type of content do consider to subscribe to my channel because I will basically share my love for fashion especially for handbags shoes clothing and I'm the type of person who always on a budget to be honest yeah so if you like it yeah, do consider to subscribe yeah and guys last but not least during this pandemic situation which I heard like um, some places are getting better and it is a very great news to be honest I still hope that all of you stay in a good health stay safe stay strong all right we can face this and see you again in my next video thank you for watching bye